how to control the height and width of a donut chart. So let's start to look how to change the size of a donut chart. So, so far we have this donut chart here, which is one of my other videos. If you want to get the source code, check out my Patreon page. And of course, got questions, check out the Discord channel. So what, to control this, we're going to play around with the aspect ratio. So if I want to scroll down here in the options, we have an option here. We can say here aspect ratio or maintain aspect ratio. And then we're going to say this set to false. By doing this, what will happen is it will change the shape of the donut chart or the size, the width and the height of it. So if you want to play around with it even a bit more further, maybe we don't want this specifically, but we want to control instead of a rectangle, which is the default. Let's say that refresh, there you are. Oh, sorry, this is a square, but we want to convert it into a rectangle. We can say the aspect ratio by default, it is set to one. That means the height and the width are one to one. But what I want to do now is I will set it two. So that means that the width will be twice the height. So if I save this refresh, we get this here quite similar. However, we could change this by making it even more narrow or longer, as you can see here, or we want to reduce this. If I go one, we have a rectangle, or sorry, a square. But if I want to have a rectangle in a vertical level, we can say here 0.8, and then it will become taller, basically. Here, you can see here, if I do 0.5, it's the height will be twice the width, and there we are. So with this, you can control to get the exact size you want.